quick hello to you, my friends at Inc Global. I, I just wanted to say thank you for having me up there in Daventry. I really enjoyed a couple of days together. Uh, it was great with some of the questions you were asking me outside of the, uh, the meeting room, uh, which shows me you've all got a hunger and a thirst to succeed at what you're doing, and I applaud that. What a great company to work for, what a great atmosphere to work in. So I want to share with you really quickly just a few things that I, I helped you with maybe over those couple of days that I want to remind you of because it was great having two days together but if you don't action it, it's all for now. It's a complete waste of time. It's down to you to take the action that you want because what you've got as a product absolutely works. Here's the proof. Check this out. <laughs> here or here. Masaltos. They work. Not only work once, they work twice, three times. I've got different pairs of these things. So what you've got with this captive audience absolutely works. Don't get hung up on the technical ins and outs. Share your stories. Do you remember the word verisimilitude that I shared with you? It's to give something the appearance of being real or true. People love a story. They'll buy with emotion and justify with logic. Here's my seven quick hits. I've got them on a computer down here. but. This is Steve's seven secrets to super sales success. Number one, knowledge isn't power. We spoke about that. It's the application of knowledge that counts. So learn enough about your market by all means and then go and apply it. Pick up the phone, talk to the right people regularly. Number two, be fit for purpose. I love the fact that we're out at 6.30. Some of you at 6.35 and you know who you are. But getting out there, getting fit, getting some blood pumping, be fit for purpose. Your magazines are fit for purpose. You too need to be that within the business. Number three, don't live in the past. Whatever happened yesterday, if it was bad news day, you didn't get the deal, forget it. Move on, learn from it and move on. Do you remember the phrase, don't, no, no, what was it? <laughs> Do you remember the phrase? I don't remember it. The past is for reference, not for residence. Don't live in the past, move on. Number four, surround yourself with positive people. Look to your left and right now. I'll bet you, you have not got people that are doom, gloom, despondent, negativity. That stuff's rubbish. Negative people will drag you down. But I don't think at Inc. you've got too many of those because the culture within the business will weed out people with that negative activity. It's no good. But surround yourself with positive, upbeat people and you'll reap the rewards. Number five, resist the attraction of distraction. We've all got a load of stuff going on, right? WTF, write that up, put it on the wall. I wanna see it when I come in next. Where's the focus? WTF, stay focused on what you're doing. Don't let other things distract you. Get stuff done on purpose. Number six, get out of your comfort zone. Nothing great happens in your comfort zone. Things, the outside pressure will just shrink in on you all the time. You've gotta find things that maybe you don't feel normally that comfortable with and get comfortable being uncomfortable. Get out of your comfort zone. And finally, my seven day test. Who took my challenge? Who's managed to get past day one so far? Seven days of no complaining. And when you can do it, I promise you, your world will rock. If I can help you any further, just give me a shout. Email me, write to me, call me, get me on Facebook. Did you join my Sales Made Simple group yet on Facebook? Some good conversations in there that just might help you along the way. But uh, do connect with me, do keep in touch. I wanna to hear how well you're doing, but I wish you every success for the year ahead and hopefully we'll meet again. Cheers for now.